trying to trying to keep up with the Tech Exeter conference, which is on Friday. I think you can still get a ticket. I don't think it's fully booked yet. Um, and sort of work round it with ideas of, of my own. I'd, I'd suggested to them having a workshop about how learning is moving online and the implications of that and how stories about that had changed over time. Well, during lockdown, before lockdown, during lockdown, after lockdown and, and whatever's going on now because there's a, there's a sort of story there that gets speeded up or slowed down and AI has come in, AI sort of assumes other things have already happened when in fact they haven't, or else the people investing in it are making some quite quite major assumptions. I'll, I'll, I'll say more about this. I'm hoping to slice up bits of this show into shorter clips for YouTube, but I ramble too much. There may not be many of them that, that actually work in that way. But um, I'll try it again tomorrow on The Wild Show. And on the, the drama show, obviously, will be fiction. There'll be a large element of fiction in that between 8 and 10. But between 10 and 12, I'll try and explain some of this to JD and to Chris. And it may, may not make more sense then when I don't have as much opportunity to just ramble. But... Um, I think what's happening is that the 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 university now is is thinking about being a digital university, but not necessarily an online university. There's a bit of online, but that's extra to the rest of it, which continues on the same model but enhanced by digital. I think I think it's something like that. But I'll come back to that, and especially I'll come back to it after the conference when I've got a better idea of it. Um, I'm relying on Twitter as a as as hints of relevant links, and there's a there's something I, I've found recently and have, have um, uploaded a link to Chris Temple Murray, who's who works at the at Exeter College. He's going to be one of the speakers. He'll be, be talking about AI and what what can what can be done to enhance education. But there's a there's a very interesting YouTube clip already there. Um, if you if you're searching for it, Chris Tim, Chris Temple Murray subject specific should find it, or else the the link from W E N O T N O will be there, and he. He talks about um, this is in college, so this is an FE age group. How he how he teaches, inf let's say, information technology or web skills, digital skills. He he he's saying that you can start if you. It's, it's aimed at teachers who are trying to do that or are assigned to do that, and he's saying that the skills are already probably there in the group. And if you if you just encourage the people who know something to talk to other people, that will cope with most of it. And then you might have to add things afterwards. But he, he also says that um, things like Microsoft Office are are to be left behind. So I'm not quite sure when, what age group those are supposed to be taught in schools. But web design or animation or um, user engagement is much more interesting and he, he prefers that as a direction but and also encouraging i think he ta he ta he's fairly explicit about this that, that the, the student the learner if they've got a phone or have got spare time at home they can use it to enhance what they learn in the class daytime and that's the bit I think I am going to rave on more, more at this point. I'll go back to music in a moment, moment or two. Um, no, I'll, I'll describe it later on. Rus it, just in short, Russell Prue has got a, a Sunday lunchtime show. So the education part of it 
is is only part of it. But his his guest this week, this last Sunday, um, it was it was well, it was more it was all about Sunday lunch. Let's be fair. The scope of this show now is Sunday lunchtime, and they were saying that um, people shouldn't be browsing their phones during Sunday lunch, and that's that's fair enough. But what I'm hoping is that the balance of that, how the mobile phone might be uh, a possible um, complement to education, that that Russell's show and his guests will cover that um, on some future occasion. Uh, going back, going back to some music. Some music. This is from John John's playlist. You can find John's playlist for We Not Know on Phonic FM on YouTube. This is Sam Smith. 